Hi, we are the ecosystem underdogs. IBM Watson X dot data is a data management solution for collecting, storing, curing, and analyzing all your enterprise data with a single unified data platform. It provides a flexible and reliable platform that is optimized to work on open data formats. Welcome to the dashboard with information surrounding the infrastructure, recent jobs, and more. The Infrastructure Manager page is where you can design your Watson X dot data by provisioning engines, catalogs, buckets, and databases. Think of this as your one-stop shop for everything data. This is the connection between Watson X dot data and our data sources. As you can see, we are connected through an engine catalog bucket stack from Presto to Hive. The S3 bucket contains the data object. The catalog shows the Hive data and we are utilizing the Presto engine. To derive value from the data set, we can use the analytics tool to explore the data. In this case, we use the simple open source BI tool, Apache Superset. We created a query against the data lake house in IBM Watson X.data using the Presto engine. This resulted in a virtual data set, meaning it is not a data set imported to the Superset tool. It is a data set defined by an open connection to Presto. Presto is a distributed SQL query engine with the capability to query vast data sets located in different data sources, thus solving the data problem at scale. A handful of visualizations were created in Superset. The visualizations were assembled into a dashboard intended for use by the various departments of the Great Outdoors Company. The first tab is an overview of the products across sales regions, showing the relative contribution by product we can see that North Europe and South Europe are the smallest regions in terms of overall sales. It is also clear that eyeglasses product type leads profits for the entire Great Outdoors company. The remainder of the tabs are broken out by department intended to show the performance of each department over the past three years. The camping department shows solid growth across all regions. The golf department has seen significant growth in all regions over the past year. If we look at the detailed version, which breaks out the profits further by product, we can see that the iron and wood shows significant growth in all regions. So we can further filter and look at the iron and woods products, which are driving that growth. Yeah. A look at the mountaineering department shows that Great Outdoors started selling mountaineering products only two years ago. There is steady growth across all regions, particularly for the tools. A closer look at tools shows the product with the greatest growth in profits. Outdoor Protection Department is the biggest disappointment, showing a steady decline in profits year over year across all regions. The Personal Accessories Department is responsible for Great Outdoors' largest source of profits, eyeglasses closely followed by watches. In many cases, the zone sunglasses are a solid bestseller. We also filtered out low-performing and or steady-performing products in order to highlight the products with the greatest profit growth over the past two or three years. Retro, introduced to the lineup only two years ago, is poised to overtake Zone as the most profitable product sold by the Great Outdoors Company. If we go back to Watson X dot data, we can see the queries executed to produce our dashboard. For a more detailed view into the performance of our Watson X dot data lake house, we can look at the details of the queries executed, paying particular attention to the query execution time, processor time, memory utilized, etc. Drill in for more detail, view the query plan that was executed, and more. We also took the liberty of connecting Cognos Analytics to our lake house and auto-generate a few insights from the data. Our data lake house happens to use Hive as a repository, and Hive is a key part of our architecture. And we've adopted Watson X, and Andrew has begun modeling the data and wants to collaborate with me to make sure this is effective as we drive to implement AI into our workflows. What I'm going to do is bring this into our business analytics platform, which is Cognos Analytics. IBM has been driving AI adoption across our, our customer and business partner base for many years now and has infused the Watson predictive engine into many of our offerings, including Cognos Analytics. Let me show you one other aspect here. That is only one of many data sources that Cognos Analytics can access. What we're going to do is point the virtualization layer against that data source. All I would need to do is go in, create a data server connection, and use one of the many engines that are available 
out of the box with the product. We just select that and give it a name for our lake house. As you can see within Cognos Analytics, we have brought to bear the Watson engine and infused it into our offerings for years. As you can see, we have a natural language assistant where we can go in and select that data source. And this is our natural language Watson infused assistant where we can go in and start asking questions about the data. When it was brought in here, it began reading the data and you can see some of the fields, total profit and so forth. Now, I can ask it a wide variety of things. Maybe I want to start by finding out what my top five most profitable products are. Maybe I want to look at this by product brand. I merely ask the question using just natural language. I can see immediately the results here. I can change the visualization. Maybe I'm a numbers guy initially. I want to see the bottom line. These are my top products. And I can see immediately, far and away, Hailstorm is our top product. I can use this natural language to just create a dashboard. And as you can see, in seconds, it creates this nice professional looking dashboard for me. And I can see a breakdown of a variety of things. Our number one seller right now is Hailstorm, followed by Star Extreme and so forth. I can change visualizations around. For example, Word Cloud, that would make sense. That's something that is very visually appealing. I'm not really interested in that particular visualization, but I am interested in this one. Let's take a look at it. This is actually a driver analysis object. The continuum here, starting from 0 to 100, shows the level of predictiveness that some of these other data attributes or data elements that I have in my, my source have in predicting profitability. So as I move from left to right, they're more predictive. So if we start over here, something like color has 14% predictive strength. As we move further right, a, a larger combination of data elements together will help predict at a very high value of 64%. And this is just the tip of the iceberg, for example, and I won't go into all of this, but you can go into a freeform exploratory interface that you can see right here. It created a decision tree. It buckets the combinations of data and walks us through exactly which ones and which combinations have the greatest predictive strength. This could be very useful in, in putting into our dashboard. These can then be saved back to the portal itself. And finally, this is integrated in with collaborative tools such as Slack. There's a variety of different ways that I could share this. I can include a link to this. Anyone that, uh, that access this that I shared with on our Slack channel could immediately dive right into this visualization. And I've saved it out to the Share Slack platform. Here's our Slack instance. And as you can see, I just shared this dashboard that we just created. Further illustrating the point that data can be brought together into a lake house, which can then be leveraged as a source for high performance analytics using the tool of choice. In our examples, two separate BI tools were used, but there is nothing stopping you from performing predictive analytics, prescriptive analytics, or running ML AI models against the lake house. So there you go. Watson X can enable you to bring the full impact of AI at scale using trusted data to you and your customers' organizations. So how does your calendar look? We'd love to get together and see what Watson X can do for you.